Hey guys, welcome to Free Network Channel. Today I'm gonna learn you guys how to find subdomains from a web browser. Instead of going to websites where they host API tool for finding subdomain. So from my video you have already known about subdomains. I told you guys what is a subdomain. So subdomains are you know subdomains of a main domain. That is what I told you guys. So let's not waste time and let's kick it into it. All right, so first of all, you have to, before we find subdomains, we have to click on our data. Our data is the most important thing in this part of the video. All right, so once you click on data, I want you guys to go to any web browser you want or you choose. And But for my video, I'm gonna use Chrome. So for the Chrome, I'm using it. That there are some flags on the Chrome. Well, actually, all web browsers have flags on the Chrome, where they give us, you know, some kind of, you know, results from the searches we make. Well, for us, I'm going to use this. So I'm going to show you guys one of the flags, which is called a site. Well, when you use site, and it gives you guys all about, I mean, the do domain that you have. So I'm going to use this site Spotify.com. That is because I already, already searched for that. That is why it is on the key side of the latest search and the, the other searches. So I'm going to use sites for the to find my, I mean, to, as an example, to tell you guys how to use this method. All right. So after clicking on the sites, I want you guys to uh, click on sites for the Well, you guys can search that because it's not on your app, but I'm going to click on that. Once you're in the sites for the there, uh, there we go. We have all the subdomains here. We have coffee.spotify.com. Well, coffee, it is a sub and a Spotify, that is the domain. So that is called subdomain. If we have a www.spotify.com, the www doesn't make anything. So that is called a main domain. We have openspotify.com. We have developerspotify.com. We have expertspotify.com. We have artist.spotify.com. Newsroom, open, podcasters, open, that's pretty fine. These are all the subdomains where it is 200 status okay. Its status is 200 okay, which means that you can use that to turn on your free internet. If you ever, if you have been given, you know, so which and you can use Spotify there. So that is what I'm going to show you guys. But these are not the fastest way to find a Spotify.com, which is 200 status okay. But if you want to use the API subdomain finder method, where you can find those methods, you will search thoroughly and you can find every host that is hidden and that is known on a main domain, you can find there once you use a subdomain API finder. So that is what I'm, I want to show you guys. So if you have watched the video, I hope you guys like the video because this video some time to make this video. So I hope you guys like the video and make and please share if you want your others to know about these other actors or other people who are newbie or newbie to these things. Please share the video and make sure to like and subscribe if you're a new watcher right now watching the video. So please, this is a short video from me and I thank you guys for watching.